Hi, my name is Amir Sherah Mkisari and I am from class L64 and EGP Block 2. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to Miss Yeti and my fellow peers. Today, I am going to be talking about an issue which is common among people nowadays. I don't know about you guys, but for me, I procrastinate often, every day. Am I proud of it? No. So as a professional procrastinator, I am going to teach you on how to procrastinate. Step 1, don't, because it will only burden you in the future. What is procrastination actually? It is the action of delaying or postponing something, for example your work. Let me give you a visual example on postponing your work. Well, teacher just gave me this work and since the due is 4 p.m., why don't I just put this first and watch some YouTube videos and do it later. After watching the videos, and I haven't done every sing any single thing on my work. The due is in an hour. Ugh. Why do we tend to procrastinate? One reason is stated in the visual example I've shown just now. When we are too immersed on doing something like playing games or play online socials like Plato or PUBG, we tend to forget what you have done or studied before we started playing those games. Other reasons are laziness, lack of motivation, lack of confidence and lack, I mean, fear of failure. Even if we do procrastinate, I am very sure that you are aware of its consequences. One obvious impact is the work that you have not done yet is piled up. And the more you think about it, the more pressured and stressed you get. This may impact your mental health and the overload pressure you keep in may even bring to serious cases such as depression or even anxiety. My advice to you, don't, ever con don't even consider of procrastinating your work, but, even, but if you don't have any other choice than doing so, try your best to not do it daily or often. It will only harm you. Before I end my speech, I would like to present you a quote by Abraham Lincoln You cannot escape a responsibility of tomorrow and by evading it today That's all I have thank you for your attention